everybody, it's a Crazy Fan Girl Shime. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. So today we're going to be reacting to the Wonder Vision trailer, and a lot of us are very excited for this, including me. But I am very not skeptical about it, but I'm interested in what it's actually about because with the small, very small preview we got at the Super Bowl, um, like the trailers that usually happen during the segments and during the halftime time i don't know i'm not american i don't know how these things work but i just know that trailers come out when that stuff happens um but we did see a little bit and i did say in the reaction video i did for disney plus that it is possible that wanda is recreating and just creating all these little visions in her mind visions <laughs> But she's creating all these moments that she hoped to have had with the real vision. And I'm excited to see how that works because her her magic is so powerful. And she I think she's one of the most underrated Marvel characters. Because in all honesty, I think they did downplay her a lot in these past few movies. Because she's a very powerful... Um, well, in, in different comics, she's either evil, good, or there's a mixture. I... I really feel for her, and um, I f I'm, I'm interested to see what she's going to do on herself, because obviously we've seen her use these powers on other people. But anyway, let's stop talking. I'm actually really excited for this trailer, so let's just jump straight into it. But before that, please remember to like, subscribe, and comment if you enjoyed this video, but also to keep up to date with all my other reactions to more TV show trailers, movies, and video games. So without further ado, let's jump straight into this. What? <gasps> that was the original comic book costume. We are an unusual couple, you know. Oh, I don't think that was ever in question. Okay, I'm going to rewatch that. I'll be back. Okay. In all honesty, I'm confused <laughs> as to what's going on. But from rewatching it, it kind of seems like not that Vision's alive, but maybe because, you know, he is one of the Infinity Stones, I'm guessing maybe his presence is still, how should I say, around, I guess? Um, not as a ghost, I mean, but maybe just because, you know, he was actually, like, one of, like, one of the most powerful, like, superheroes because of the fact that he gained his powers from the Infinity Stone. Also, I like that callback to his original suit from the comic books. That was cool! Um, that was, that got me excited. I was like, hmm, even though it does look quite childish, but it does kind of suit, kind of like, not the tone of the show, but it seems kind of like that quirky side of the show because, obviously, with Wanda's powers, it can change and everything. Um, I think there was one particular scene where Wanda seems to be in just like a, a modern day home and she's changing everything kind of to look a little bit like as if it's like the 60s or the 80s I'm not sure which time periods these are but it seems like she's trying to just change it all and then perhaps is creating different versions not different versions but maybe like an alternate version of Vision through the memory she has of him um especially with how they say like when they got married why they don't have kids etc um that's I think that's why she's getting stuck because they they never got to that part they never I don't think they ever spoke about that either no not in the movie but it obviously seems like they never got that far in their relationship to think about that or it was because of the fact that you know he was a robot and it's interesting as well to think about the fact that you know she creates the idea that they did have kids etc so i'm excited to see where this actually goes again i'm intrigued and i'm excited to see what happens especially with all the teleporting stuff i was confused by that i'm glad they're not showing too much because um even though Mandalorian is totally different. A lot of people were complaining about that trailer saying it was boring. But then me and my friend were talking last night about that and saying, you know, they're probably not showing everything in a trailer because they want to keep it all, not a secret, but they want to keep it a surprise so that, you know, 
especially with trailers nowadays, we a lot of us know that most of the story is told in a trailer. And, you know, when we go to the movie, it's like, okay, this is the part, that's that part, that's that part. So, yeah, I'm glad that these trailers are short and it's kind of keeping us on the questioning side of things. So I'm excited either way and I'm just curious about what's going to happen. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give a like, subscribe, comment, and tell me your thoughts on the trailer for WandaVision. It's exciting, but also I just looked on Twitter as well, and I saw this before. A lot of people were talking about it. That's a lot of people were saying, like, what if the twist on the title is supposed to be Wanda's vision? So it's her vision of her, their life together. It's not Wanda vision, as in, you know, that, you know, just them as a couple. So I'm guessing maybe it is a twist on the words. So again, I'm guessing she's playing on the fact with her memories and just like, you know, filling in the gaps with maybe what else she thinks was possible in their relationship. So that's going to be exciting, but also just like, I wonder what sort of impact that's going to happen. But I'm also excited because there's more, obviously, information coming out about the other Marvel TV shows, obviously, with Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I'm excited. Oh, I hope we get a trailer for that soon, like, individually. That's going to be exciting. And obviously, I don't, well, I don't think Loki has even done a lot because I remember when they started filming, that was time when the coronavirus was, like, you know, heightening, etc. So I'm not sure if we'll get that show until next year. But... I hope that we do get the Falcon and the Winter Soldier soon because I really want to watch that show. It looks so good and I, I, again, I always like love the Winter Soldier so um, and the Falcon as well. So I want to see like what happens in the show. But anyway, I hope we get more trailers soon because why not? <laughs> so again, thank you guys so much for watching this and I'll see you guys in the next video. Crazy Fangirl out. Woo!